A lot of people call this a rebuilding year. You know, we had seven freshmen coming in. A lot of people, you know, thought we were just going to be, you know, a, a tough team, but everybody was going to win over us. Jones spots Dillard cutting down the floor. You're all step for two. Buzzer beating shot by Wilkins. Down it. We you know us playing against Oregon, us playing against Stanford at home, and South Dakota State winning that game. I think it's just going to prepare us for what we're really looking for, and that's to play in March. Three on two, Dillard goes behind the back. No look pass to Morrison. Morrison goes off, blasts it in. Quick jump pass and one as Sierra Dillard inbounded it to Hemphill. I really want to do the best for my team as they mean a lot to me. And UB as well, and being from Buffalo and being able to play for my city, that means a lot to me. And I would just love to continue winning and making the city proud. Now full court pass from Dillard into the hands of Hemphill. Hemphill is the glass and she put it in. A buzzer beating basket for Buffalo. Paul, Hannah scores up a three from the baseline and hits it. There's the open one. But she was the reason why this thing changed around. And because of her, I rejuvenated myself as a coach. And I am excited about coaching this team in this game again because she walked through that door and gave me an opportunity to coach her. Us at UB, we, we know exactly what she is and how special she is. I know we've been here three years, but thank you for adopting me into the Buffalo family and Buffalo community. This, these fans are unbelievable. I want to thank my family for being number one, my number one fans behind me. I want to thank everybody from the bottom of my heart. And thank you to the Brada family and every family that's been supporting us from the jump. Thank you, guys. You deserve an opportunity to be in the midst of this game, to be free from it all. Go out there and be free. Go out there and run fast and, and make a mistake. Go out there and do something right. Go out there and attack. Go out there and fight. It's about to fight. That's a streaky shooter in Sierra Dillard. And when she hits one, it could be a long day for Kent State. for a ball screen. Morrison obliges, now rolls off of the ball screen, gets to the basket, draws the contact, and one. The Bulls get the last lap over Kent State as they knock the Golden Flashes out of the tournament. It's a semifinal matchup between the top-seeded Central Michigan Chippewas and your fourth-seeded Buffalo Bulls. The games between these two teams have been epic for the last couple of years. You need to have something unexpected ready in order to surprise a really good team like Central Michigan. These are two great basketball teams, and guess what? We got two great head coaches, too. This is going to be a chess match today. A quick pass all the way up the court. Now to Summer Hemphill. She caught Central Michigan sleeping. Dillard gets into the paint, draws the contact, and won. How many times? Has she completed the three-point play? Hudson tries to blitz Sierra, but she was ready for it. Gets around Hudson now, gets into the paint, kicks it to Hall. Three-pointer for Hannah, you betcha! And the clock will expire as Central Michigan gets set packing. I think the time is now for you to be unleashed. And I know who you are. I know I'm staring in the face of a champion. Let's go out there and take it. Here comes Hemphill in transition. A dump pass to Hall. Hannah sets her feet, fires, yes! Now an NBA range three for Dillard, and she sticks it! Hall now looks to penetrate, dumps it to the far baseline for Wilkins. Courtney launches a three and she hits it! 
now reverses it to Dillard. That's about as open as Sierra's gonna be all year. She got fouled and hit the three as she'll head to the free throw line. One more to Wilkins. Courtney with a third chance at a three and she drills it! Fans can dust off those dancing shoes again. Your 2019 Mid-American Conference Tournament Champions, the Buffalo Bulls. We didn't have all 16 people, the coaches, the trainers, the managers locked in the way that we were. I gotta talk about these young ladies here who just kept believing, kept fighting. When everybody came, when nobody came, they stayed locked into the foxhole and they kept trying to find the word belief. You, you wish like that um, when you're a kid to be playing at this level, on this stage, in front of fans, in front of coaches that you look up to all your life. It's about you and your individual story collectively come together in that box up for us to do what we always do. Stolen away by the Scarlet Knights, but taken right back by Hall. Transition three now for Dillard. She steps into one and drills in from the right wing. An impossible shot and she makes it look easy. She gets blitzed on a ball screen. Double team, where's the open body? Hall now has it. Jones is rolled by herself. She can't handle it. Has to chuck up a three and makes it off glass and in. That's exactly how you want to see this quarter end. We win as our story. That's all that matters. Nothing else in this world matters other than your time right now. You gotta play the game, go take it. Eddie A again there for an offensive rebound. Gets it over to Dillard. Dillard, pump fake, Hall, sets her feet, fires, yes! <laughs> tournament as Buffalo is made for March. You have a bunch of fighters, don't you? And I said, yeah, I do. I'm so fortunate to have a bunch of fighters who understand what they're fighting for. But on Wuka saves it from going out of bounds, gets it to Sierra, she's gonna pop another one and Diller hits it. It's just effort and hustle and they're getting big plays. Ball screen coming, Dangerfield loses it, stolen away by Hemphill, all the way up to Jones, she's got a wide open layup, Autumn at the basket, finishes, timeout UConn as Gino Ariema wants to talk things over. This gym is going to remember the day the Bulls visit the Pavilion. It's just beginning, they got so much more in their tank, we have not seen the best of Buffalo women's basketball yet. Oh!